To make this scarf with hood, I used the yarn baggy wool the, from the brand Casasol. The recommended needle is 5mm. I used a 5mm crochet hook, scissors, stitch marker and a needle. Now I'm going to show you how to take the measurements uh, to make to adapt this pattern to any size from the fingers of one arm to the other side of the body and the, to the fingers of the other hand. And then you have to add the size of the pocket that you want. If you, or for example, if you want the pockets of 10 centimeters, you have to add 10 centimeters in one side and 10 centimeters on the other side. So take the measurement from the fingers to the uh, to the fingers of the other side plus the size of the pockets. This is the size of the scarf, and then you have to take the measurements of the hood. And to take the measurements for the hood, you have to take from the neck to the front part of the head. The, you have to take this size and is from the middle of the scarf to one side and the same from the middle of the scarf to the other side. So if you have 20 centimeters, you have to make 40 centimeters. Start on one side and make all the hood. And make all the number of rows and make the number of rows that you need to have the size of the hood to the top of the head. So, start now with the stitches. You have to start making a chain uh, of to take to make the width of the scarf. In my case, for a 5 years old child, I made 16 chains, a chain of 16 stitches. Once you have the 16 stitches, you have to make a a half double crochet on each half double crochet. One half double crochet on each on each chain. One half double crochet on each chain. Once you have all the half double crochet, you have to make a chain two, turn and make again one half double crochet on each stitch. One half double crochet on each stitch. Once you are at the end, you have to repeat the same turn, chain two, and make one half double crochet on each half double crochet. This is what you have to repeat to have the length of the scarf that you need. In here I am making a small sample and uh, but you can see uh, better which is the shape of the scarf. Now you have to sew the sides of the pockets. So this side and the other side of both pockets.
and now you have to uh, take the measurements for the hood once you have the sizes of the hood You have to start making one half double crochet um, on each uh, change of of row. Once you, on the space of where you change the row, there is there is where you have to make the half double crochet. So make the make one half double crochet on each space to have the size of the hood. make a chain 2, once you are at the end, chain 2 and start again with one half double crochet on each half double crochet. So repeat one half double crochet on each half double crochet all the rows to have the size of the hood. Once you have the size of the hood, you have to sew the, the top part to finish the hood. Then I'm going to show you how to make the decoration of Dinos Dinosaur. You have to start making a 6 single crochet magic ring. Once you have the magic ring, you have to pull the yarn to close the circle. And start with 3 repetitions of 1 single crochet and 1 increase. 1 single crochet and 1 increase. Repeat again, one single crochet and one increase. The last repetition, one single crochet and one increase. The following row you have to make two single crochet and one increase.
Repeat again, two single crochet and one increase. And this is what you have to repeat to the end, two single crochet and one increase. On the following row you have to make three single crochet and one increase. You have to continue making four single crochet and one increase and five single crochet and one increase. And then you have to make two rows with two rows with one single crochet around. Two rows with one single crochet around. Once you have the two rows you have to cut the yarn leaving a long tail for sewing. In my case I made 10 pieces and you only have to sew the 10 pieces on the top of the hood and on the back of the hood. And you finished the hood.